And generally spacious Sarah Gross explains. Compared to normal fruit flies, these Parkinson's disease mutant flies show deteriorating motor functions. But when these flies are put through an activation process using a component of green tea, their movement is restored. Called EGCG, the component which is also found in red wine, activates a key protein in the body called AMP kinase. When activated, the protein helps to protect brain cells from dying. In three to five years time, the research team hopes to move from experimenting this therapy on fruit flies to experimenting on mice, as well as the brain cells of patients with Parkinson's disease. Now eventually the team hopes that this will develop into a drug which can be used for these patients. The current treatment for Parkinson's is a drug known as L-DOPA, which offers symptomatic therapy. Whilst they can actually improve the symptom, current medication cannot stop cannot reverse the degeneration process, so hence it's important to come up with something that can offer real protection to the brain cells from dying. There are benefits of drinking green tea, but in this case, uh, you know, we have something even more potent than drinking uh, green tea. So hopefully, medication center around AMPK activation uh, can provide uh, a real uh, and, and faster benefit uh, to the Parkinson's patient than, uh, than uh, green tea could uh, at that stage. Associate Professor Lim adds that if a drug were to be developed, it would target patients with early stage Parkinson's disease to protect their brain cells from further damage. Sarah Gross, Channel News Asia, Singapore. Oh, good to know. Green tea and antioxidant. I like green tea. Recent to drink. Here's just what I want to know. Green tea, does it have caffeine or not? Yeah, I really don't know. That's... <laughs>